Taco Bell promised some exciting and delicious developments at its Live Moss Live event in February, here are all the tacos, burritos, sides, and sweet treats you can expect to see at the chain in 2024. Cravings boxes have been around since 2021, but there hasn't been a veggie version until now. Taco Bell is one of the few fast food places offering something other than fries and grilled cheese without meat, making it a bit of a default destination for many vegetarians and vegans, so this move is pretty much a no-brainer. The veggie cravings boxes are set to cost $5.99, which is the same as the meat version. To order, you start by picking a drink, then one specialty veggie menu item, followed by a classic menu item, and finally, a side. This is a much better deal than buying all of those items separately, as they would add up to about twice as much as at $5.99 price point. Costs are rising seemingly everywhere nowadays, and even popular fast food chains aren't immune to inflation. Taco Bell's Cravings Value menu has always been a reliable place to find some deals, but it's been a long time since the cheapest items on that menu cost less than a dollar. However, you could still get a cheesy roll-up for just one Washington in early 2024. Alas, those value menu prices increased on January 11th. The cheesy roll-ups remain the cheapest choice, but they've been bumped up to $1.19. The prices on this menu now range from $1.19 to $2.99, so there's only a $1.80 difference between the cheapest option and the most expensive, which is the loaded beef nachos. Taco Bell has brought back its double-stacked tacos for 2024. Their claim to fame is that the soft tortilla on the outside serves as a wrapper for a crispy taco inside, while melted cheese keeps the stacks together. They come with seasoned beef, cheese, nacho cheese sauce, and lettuce, and Fiesta strips are there to provide even more crunch. When these tacos first showed up on the menu in 2016, they cost only $1, but in 2024, they'll be priced at $1.99. They were originally offered in three different flavors, cool habanero, spicy sweet, and nacho crunch, but in 2024, there's only one version. Of course, you can always customize them by requesting an add-on like Chipotle sauce. Stackers are another blast from the past, returning to the Taco Bell menu. They're essentially super cheesy beef quesadillas containing seasoned beef, a three-cheese blend, and nacho cheese sauce grilled between tortillas. They're known as stackers rather than true quesadillas because the layers fold to stack, which makes them less flimsy and therefore easier to eat. Me want food! <laughs> Back in 2017, stackers were only $1, but in 2024, they're more than double that cost, at $2.19. There was a soft launch in Tucson, Arizona in the summer of 2023, which must have gone well, considering that the 2024 relaunch is nationwide. Cheesy double beef burritos were originally on the Taco Bell menu way back in 2008, and they lasted until 2010. Then they made a comeback in 2016 and another one in 2022. Hopefully, they'll stay on the regular rotation for a little while longer this time. They're currently being priced at $2.79. These burritos contain seasoned beef, nacho cheese sauce, seasoned rice, reduced fat sour cream, three cheese blend, and fiesta strips for crunch. You can also ask for them grilled or opt for a fresco style that replaces dairy with tomatoes for no added cost. Another new item on the Cravings Value menu is the three-cheese chicken flatbread melt, which appears to be replacing the chicken chipotle melt. The ingredients inside are the same – chicken, a melty three-cheese blend, and chipotle sauce. However, the thicker bread makes it more filling than the tiny chicken chipotle melt. While the chicken chipotle melts cost $1.99 in 2023, the three-cheese chicken flatbread melts will set you back $2.29. Some of the previous versions of Taco Bell's chicken flatbreads included one with bacon ranch and a loaded version. There were even steak and beefy potato options. The chain tested out the current version with two flavors in 2023, though only one survived. The chicken enchilada burrito is yet another comeback story on the Taco Bell menu in 2024. Despite the name, it's not quite an enchilada since there's no sauce on the outside. The filling is a mixture of chicken, seasoned rice, three cheese blend, reduced fat sour cream, and red sauce. You can also order it grilled or fresco style for no extra cost. The filling is reminiscent of typical enchilada flavors if you activate your culinary imagination. The seasoning on the rice helps with the illusion. The chicken enchilada burrito first appeared on the menu in the summer of 2023, but then it disappeared after just a few months. We'll see if it settles in for a longer stay this time around. One eternity later. Loaded beef nachos showed up in a test market in 2023, and they proved to be popular enough to make it to the full menu. Not only do these nachos consist of seasoned beef, they also contain beans for added heft. 
All of the other ingredients are wet ones, making for a messy but tasty version of nachos. The toppings include reduced fat sour cream, guacamole, and red sauce. They also come with nacho cheese sauce instead of melted cheese. If you want to add other ingredients like jalapenos, you're of course welcome to do so, though you'll have to pay extra. And this is a relatively light option. Even with added guacamole, it only adds up to 440 calories. If you've been wondering when Taco Bell was going to start offering savory empanadas, the answer is 2024. The chain had previously offered sweet empanadas, though they were discontinued back in 2019. Known as cheesy chicken crispanadas, their crispy outside looks a lot like the turnovers at McDonald's, so we're guessing that they'll come pre-made rather than being made on site. The outside is pastry dough, while the inside contains half white meat and half dark meat chicken, melted cheddar and mozzarella cheese, and a mysterious combination of spices. And they'll come with spicy ranch sauce for dipping. The crispinat is released on February 15th and are only set to be out for a limited time, so you'll have to act fast to snag some. When they were being tested in limited locations in 2023, a single one cost $3.49. You could also get them as part of a box deal for $8.49. Another exciting development is a whole new cantina chicken menu that's set to arrive in March and is already available in some places. Once it rolls out everywhere, there will be five new items featuring new ingredients, specifically a new type of chicken, shredded purple cabbage, pico de gallo, and a new cantina sauce hot sauce packet. All of these new items come with slow-roasted rotisserie-style chicken, and the menu is set to include a cantina chicken crispy taco and a cantina chicken soft taco. The crispy version comes with a three-cheese blend and creamy jalapeno sauce with cheese melted on the outside. Meanwhile, the soft version contains purple cabbage, lettuce, cheese, pico de gallo, and avocado ranch sauce. The cantina chicken burrito comes with everything the soft taco has, plus chipotle sauce. The cantina chicken quesadilla contains a three-cheese blend and chipotle sauce. Finally, the new cantina chicken bowl will completely replace the power menu bowl. It comes with black beans, cheese, seasoned rice, lettuce, pico de gallo, and purple cabbage. It also comes with avocado ranch sauce, reduced fat sour cream, and guacamole. Plus, there are a variety of meals and boxes based around these new items. March cannot come soon enough. Taco Bell has offered kits at grocery stores for years now, and in 2024, they're set to offer cravings kits as part of a partnership with Kraft Heinz. The initial offerings are Chipotle chicken quesadilla and Crunchwrap Supreme varieties. You could buy all of the ingredients from the kits individually, but then you wouldn't get the proprietary spices or sauces that make them taste like Taco Bell. Keep in mind, though, that you'll have to add your own protein and toppings. The quesadilla kit comes with tortillas, Velveeta cheese sauce, and Chipotle creamy sauce, while the Crunchwrap kit comes with flour tortillas, cheese sauce, tostada shells, and taco seasoning. Also, since these kits don't come with any hot sauces, they're potentially a great way to use up all those extra Taco Bell packets you have lying around your house. Another crunchy, cheesy menu item making its way back to Taco Bell is the Cheez-It Crunch Wrap. It was briefly available for two weeks back in 2022, along with a Cheez-It Tostada. With this new development, Taco Bell customers can expect to find a Cheez-It that's big enough to fit inside of a Crunch Wrap. Like the Crunch Wrap of 2022, this edition will house one giant Cheez-It, presumably with typical Crunch Wrap stuffings of beef, lettuce, tomatoes, and more. You're going to get to try the Cheez-It Crunch Wrap and Tostada at every single Taco Bell in America. Yeah? The 2024 Halloween season is scheduled to have a surprise in store for Taco Bell fans, as the chain is bringing back either the Mexi Melt or the Caramel Apple Empanada for the spooky holiday. The Mexi Melt consists of a flour tortilla, melted cheese, beef, and pico de gallo. It was removed from menus back in 2019 despite being fairly popular, so the prospect of a Halloween resurrection is very exciting. The caramel apple empanada also exited the scene in 2019. It tasted similar to an apple pie and featured a fried empanada shell filled with gooey, spiced, and caramelly apples. It was warm, crunchy, and comforting, so it would be a perfect fit for October. Taco Bell diners should also expect to see chicken nuggets and cheesy street chalupas sometime in 2024. They were tested at certain locations for a limited time in October 2023 and performed well enough for promotion. Taco Bell is no stranger to chalupas, which stand out thanks to their fried flatbread-like shells. Based on what was on the menu in October, the cheesy street chalupa differs from the chain's chalupa supreme in two areas. It comes with either shredded chicken or marinated steak, and its shell is stuffed with mozzarella and pepper jack cheese. While Taco Bell was perfecting its chalupas, it was also testing chicken nuggets, which are marinated in jalapeno buttermilk and breaded for crunch. Any good nugget deserves an equally satisfying dipping sauce, so when Taco Bell's nuggets return, they'll be accompanied by a jalapeno honey mustard or signature bell sauce. 
Mountain Dew Baja Blast is arguably the most iconic drink on Taco Bell's menu, and soon enough, it'll be more than soda, as Baja Blast Gelato is scheduled to arrive in the summer of 2024. This cool dessert even features the drink's signature bright blue-green color. Is this good news? Yeah. If this sounds familiar, that's because Mountain Dew Baja Blast actually already got a gelato makeover back in 2023, when it was being tested out in Irvine, California. This was the first time that Taco Bell ever had a gelato on its menu, and at the time, a 3.6-ounce container sold for $2.99. Taco Bell sauce packets are getting a makeover. They've gone through some changes in the past, and this time the transformation will be more visual. These packets have been slowly evolving their look over time, as the messages printed on the packets didn't even appear until 2004. We don't know for sure what this makeover will end up looking like, but we do know at least that a new flavor is on the way in 2024 in the form of avocado verde salsa, which was confirmed at the Live Moss Live event. Taco Bell diners may be familiar with a similarly flavored green verde salsa that's one of many discontinued sauces. Although those green packets have disappeared, maybe the avocado edition will stick around for a little bit longer.